Lucid has spent a lot of time on bringing its electric vehicle, the Air, to the market. We have followed their progress as they shaped and reshaped the Air, commenced building production facilities, signed public charging deals, and set up high-tech showrooms and service centers. Yet the company's press time is dominated by a single car. The question is, is Lucid going to be a one-trick pony? A company that has only one product? In this video, we try to see what the future looks like for the EV startup. We will tell you what we know about Project Gravity, the EV that is coming right after the air. Hey there, welcome to this episode of New Vehicle Media. If you haven't subscribed or liked yet, why not do so now so you don't miss any of our new updates? Feel free to make yourself heard in our comment section too. So, you have seen the attention the Lucid Air is getting, right? It's been cold tested, taken for a spin by the CEO himself, and competed in races. It's shaping up to be a great EV, no doubt, with a long range and a raft of assistant entertainment tech. Production is expected to finally begin at the Casa Grande facility in Arizona. As an observer, it is not out of place to wonder if the company can repeat this magic with another car. After all, we have had companies that could not replicate their initial success. So, what will Lucid do next after the air? The next project, Project Gravity. We actually have an idea of what is next for Lucid via their website. There is a page aptly named Future Models. That's where the gem we're looking for is situated. Right there on the page, as you can see, is the next EV from Lucid. It is currently tagged Project Gravity. Whether the final model name is going to be named Gravity or not is not confirmed yet. Lucid is trying to be coy here, so the picture is not all telling, but we have a good idea of what to expect. Lucid even wants you to join a waiting list for the EV, meaning Lucid isn't actually trying to keep this project a super secret. Just like the whole world has been carried along in the development of the air, Lucid is inviting you to stay informed about the project Gravity. If you opt into the waiting list, you'll receive updates through your email on the journey of the new EV to production. Just how much has Lucid itself revealed about Project Gravity? Well, the company's website tells us that the Project Gravity is an SUV, and from the pictures, which are probably renders, we see that the front of the SUV is similar to the air. This suggests that the light that runs from one side to the other may become a trademark of Lucid vehicles. This is a common trick employed by new companies trying to establish a brand as it helps for the products to have visual similarities. The same thing is going on at the rear where we see the same single-piece taillight from the air. There are a lot of curves, as you can expect from a company that made the air. Lucid is also revealing the date, or more accurately, year of release of the Gravity SUV. It's coming in 2023. Lucid promises a long range. This is hardly surprising. We are talking about a company that is in the habit of bumping up the range estimates of its models. If it shapes out like the air, the SUV may be getting over 500 miles before needing a charge, although the body shape of the SUV may slightly reduce the range. Lucid says the Gravity SUV will seat seven adults comfortably thanks to the ample space in the cabin. Lucid explains it is able to carve out so much space for passengers due to the fact that it is using a miniaturized drivetrain. The drivetrain is part of the Lucid Electric Advanced Platform, LEAP, which Lucid is going to reuse for its other models. We also know what the reservation will look like. Lucid is not above favoritism, you know, as it says it will bump air owners to the front of the queue when the reservation for the gravity opens. You can also enjoy the priority if you happen to reserve the air. Now, don't say we told you, but if you really want to be first in line for the gravity, you might as well make a reservation for yourself for the air, even if you have no intention of purchasing one. We don't know when reservation for the gravity will start, but from the language used here, we see Lucid expects the air to be delivered to some buyers before the reservation for the gravity starts, which shows that both the air and the gravity are not a long way off. Just how many air owners will receive the gravity a few months after taking delivery is yet to be seen, but Lucid seems confident the air has what it takes to convert its owners to repeat customers. That's all we can glean from the official website of the company, but that won't stop us from sleuthing around and making educated guesses here and there 
as we await an official unveiling. Other info we know. The first reference to the SUV was from a video clip that was shown during the debut of the Air. The images on the SUV page on Lucid's website closely matches what we saw in the video clip. From interviews granted by the press-friendly CEO Peter Rawlinson, we know the Gravity SUV is going to be based on the same platform as the Air Sedan, a calculated move by Lucid to simplify and reduce the cost of design and development. Going by that fact, it's not difficult to predict some of the features of the Gravity SUV. We expect a large battery pack, up to 1,080 horsepower from what would likely be a dual electric motor setup, and a cabin full of the latest in gadgetry. It could also borrow the air suspension from the air. We wouldn't expect the same well-appointed interior like the air. The 34-inch display could be imported into the Gravity. Don't expect lots of physical buttons. Trunk space, too, should be ample. The SUV will most likely be produced at the Casa Grande plant. The CEO has revealed the factory was built to be flexible so as to accommodate the production of future models. He directly referenced the SUV while discussing the paint shop, so the Gravity will be the first test of the flexibility. A good off-roader? Judging by the settings of the photos on Lucid's website, we could have a capable off-roader on our hands. You won't showcase a delicate car in an uneven terrain with what appears to be a roof box, essentials for camping, and other related adventures. The clearance from the ground tells us the SUV shouldn't have problems handling rougher roads. Besides, the head of design, Derek Jenkins, has built dune buggies before joining the company, so it should be no surprise if the Gravity SUV exhibits off-roading abilities. This would pitch the SUV directly against the R1S, which Rivian is being marketed as an adventure vehicle. How close are we really to seeing the Gravity SUV being test-driven by the CEO? Rawlinson himself admits a driving prototype already exists. Knowing the CEO's penchant for cruising around town in yet-to-be-released vehicles, we guess he is hitching to hit the road in the Gravity prototype. What about the cost? There is nothing official on that front yet, but we're not averse to making guesses. Lucid is clearly a purveyor of luxury goods, so expect an electric SUV from them not to come cheap. The Air basically starts at $70,000 after the federal tax credit, so a price from $85,000 to $100,000 isn't out of order. The top model may easily clear $150,000 just like the Air. Who is competing with the Lucid Gravity? The Gravity SUV won't be short of competitors. The Ford Mustang Mach-E has already started deliveries. Tesla has the Model Y on offer and enjoys the status of being the model to beat. There is also the Volkswagen ID.4, an electric SUV from one of the most established brands in the world. Chevy's bolts are also there to take attention away from Lucid's final product. Lucid obviously has its work cut out standing out in a sea of electric SUVs. Wrap up. There are many unknowns about the Gravity SUV being teased by Lucid, but we expect to get more details as development continues. You can bet we'll be the first ones with the updates. However, we already have a glimpse of the future of Lucid. The company is definitely not resting on its laurels as it is hard at work on an SUV. Despite the spec sheet and design looking mightily attractive, Time will tell if the Gravity SUV will reach the same level of hype as its yet-to-be-released older sibling, the Air. That's what we have for you on the next thing for Lucid. If you're a fan of Lucid like some of us here, why not share your thoughts with us in the comments below? We would love to know what you think. And while you're at it, you can also give us a follow and a like so you always get our updates. Thanks for staying with us this far. We hope to see you in the next video.